Hello and welcome to the Daily Think Share. My name is Zach. I'm here to bring to you what I've been thinking about, sharing about, talking about, listening to the Doesn't Belong in Math class. If you're new to the channel, I invite you to subscribe. So this weekend, um, I celebrated my anniversary with my wife, Alyssa. And, you know, she didn't, she didn't say this to me directly. I know she doesn't watch every one of these videos, so I'm no problem saying this without her hearing it. But I know that she was, she was sort of disappointed uh, with the total thing that I created for the weekend. Because she really goes like so overboard, and um, you know, I, I could just feel that that she was not totally impressed with everything that I did, and I totally see where I went wrong. You know, I didn't, I I didn't go above and beyond like I know I totally could have. So here's my message for today: even when it feels like you've messed up, and it's like, well, the date has come and gone, so our anniversary's over, her birthday's over, like the date is over. You, it's always better late than never. There's always moments where you can still outshine, outperform, even if it's late, especially if it's like a gift for someone or an event that that is just you and that person. So here's what I'm going to do is if I've told her to save Friday, and I'm really going to try to bring it. Um, you know, it's going to be an awesome date night. I haven't figured out what I'm doing yet, but I'm printing planning on bringing it like I'm whatever all the stops are without spending an extravagant amount of money like I'm bringing it I'm bringing out the weapons and bringing out everything and I'll let you know how it goes um, maybe on Saturday or so but message of the day is it's better late than never even especially if you underperform somewhere where you can know you can do better whether it be a birthday gift or it be some kind of presentation you know even if it's like you're selling something. You can always come back and say, let me do that over again, all right? It's sometimes it's better that you made the effort knowing you left it all in the field, even if you didn't make a great first impression. So I hope this is useful. I hope this inspires someone that's messed up recently to go out there and try again, even if it it's like, oh, you're really trying to do this again? Yeah, just do it. Like, leave it all on the court. Like, you only get to live once. You know, say this for the last, last year I got to spend with Alyssa, I don't want that to be one of the memories that we had together was her having an underwhelming birthday and anniversary weekend. So that's my message. Thank you for watching. If you like this, give it a like. If you want more, subscribe. Thank you and stay weird.